Okay. So, we just got booted out of this driveway. <laughs> juicy on the way down there that we might stop we brought show them show them this stuff we uh, we are set up guys this is the ultimate fishing excursion rig right now we are i mean we brought everything known to man i uh, i got so much room because i don't have any of my kids it's just me and sam on this trip and so i brought everything i had why not <laughs> i didn't bring all my rods but i brought enough that if we run into anything we've got something to fish for so uh stay tuned we uh we will be uh yeah, we'll be keeping you guys up to date on everything going on. Uh, if we stop, we'll definitely uh, we'll whip the cameras out, man. We're going to have a great time. Thank you so much for being along with this. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you're liking and subscribing. Make sure that you guys are commenting, too. I love hearing from you guys. Thank you so much for everything you do for me and for this channel and for the support. And, uh, yeah, let's do it. First stop of the day, guys, and uh, man, that thing is juicy, but there is no access whatsoever. We're actually in a trailer park. <laughs> there's, there's trailers everywhere. So, yeah, I don't think we're gonna be able to, uh, to fish that, but I tell you, man, she is looking pretty delicious. Oh, give me something nice and nice and slimy out of that bad boy. Right in that riprap right there. Man, if there wasn't berry bushes right there, dude, I'd jump down on that. I'd just park right here and go for it. Bank's like seven feet tall right there, so that sucks. Could almost get into right here, but that's kind of shallow. Man, there's just no access. Anyways, sweet spot. We'll uh, continue looking for more. What's up guys? All right, we're here. We are at Newport. We are uh, getting uh, rigged up, and getting ready to go. And see if we can uh, see if we get something. The uh, the waves are looking pretty decent. We're uh, both pleasantly surprised at what we found. Grab you here. So this is uh, this is kind of what it's looking like right now. That's uh, that's some good stuff. I have a epic feeling today. Hammer some. 
What do you think, Sammy? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's right, dude. I'm Jack, and this is going to be good stuff. So stay tuned. Uh, I'll get the GoPro on here in a little bit. We'll, uh, yeah, we'll meet you down on the beach. Oh, this is just, this is going to be great, guys. So there was already a couple other guys here that were uh, getting rigged up to fish. So I hope we're in kind of the right spot. We just picked a spot, man. We just drove down to the first beach we found. So uh, hopefully, <laughs> hopefully we're in a good area. So anyways, we'll see you in a little bit. Oh, I can't wait. This is going to be epic. Come on, guys. There is a sandbar out here. This is a spot number three. I haven't had too much luck as far as uh, fishing goes. I haven't had any bites or anything yet, but we've been moving. You know, it's still beautiful out. We're enjoying being here, but there's a uh, there's a sandbar out here, and we're gonna see if we can get just to the other side of it and get up on the sandbar, and then maybe cast a little further into the. You know, this is the these drops that I just walked through is kind of what you want to look for when it comes to. Uh, uh, finding stuff. That's uh, that's the cat's meow for uh, surfers. They like to be in those troughs because all the crabs go down in that trough. So, anyways, now I'm on the sandbar. It's pretty good. So, uh, yeah. Tight lines, guys. This is what it's all about. You know, being out here fishing with your buddies. Whether you're catching fish or not, man, this is just such a good time. I'm so thankful I'm here. Spot number four, guys, and uh, I've had two bites in a row. First one came so quick that it surprised the crap out of me. And the second one, I, I thought I'd let him eat it, but I think it's just a drive-by, so. Well, let's uh, see what happens here. This wasn't a very good cast. There's all sorts of little, little pocket water in here, little holes. Yeah, you gotta be careful, man. This can really, this can get you if you're not careful, but. It's also right where these fish are sitting. Let's get a good one out here. Oh, wait. Got to fix bait. Let's get this bait fixed here. Make sure this isn't tangled up here. There we go. Come on, perch. I don't think anything fell out. <laughs> I turn around and I'm like, ah, oh, crap! What the fuck? <laughs> it's okay, everything in here is waterproof. There you go. Oh, wait, I see something. Oh, stop worms! Stop worms! Oh, look here! Hey! Ah, this is what. This is one of yours. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. oh good times. <laughs> well, 
I got it all on video. Hey. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I was, I was, I had, I thought I had a little bite. Yeah. And then uh, I was like, oh, that's probably just the weight skidding across the water. And then I had another little bump. I'm like, oh, that was interesting. And then right after that, another one. So I tried to set the hook. I think I pulled it out of his mouth. Uh, threw it back in, had a huge bite. Like a big tail. Like I thought I had a fish, man. I'm actually surprised I don't. It was a big bite. That's crazy. So. Okay. Okay, so surf fishing. We are uh, we're all done. This is uh, we're back up the truck. Just gonna get changed up. So uh, it sucked. I, uh, I had a bite right towards the end, but uh, I missed him. And then after that, nothing. <laughs> so we uh, we still got lots of daylight, and uh, it's still really nice. And it's kind of choppy out there, so we decided to uh, take a break. And uh, yeah, we're gonna. We're gonna roll ourselves down to the jetty, I think, and uh, try the jetty out. So, stay tuned for that. I'll talk to you guys when I get over the jetty. Well, guys, we're here at the jetty, and uh, it's still beautiful out, but it is rather windy. And uh, yeah, there's there's somebody fishing there. I don't know how he's doing, but we're uh. We're gonna give her a good hard go, full send, and uh, yeah, man. Hopefully, we get something dandy here. So the last time I was down here, which has been a couple of years, I hooked a really nice link cod. And uh, if I can find the picture, I'll link it or I'll, I'll pop it up right now. Otherwise, anyways. But yeah, we're we're, we're hoping to uh, we're hoping to you know we're hoping to slay some donkeys here. There's some big lanes, definitely some black bass. Like I said, man, we still got the uh, the cooler, and uh, I think we're both uh, both ready to uh, finally maybe get some fish. So, anyways, yeah, stay tuned. Hopefully, this is uh, this is going to be our uh, our lucky spot today. Alright guys, so we are finally to the first spot. I'm gonna try some of these big bite baits. Thank you, Mr. Tackle Box, for sending me these bad boys. I've actually had these for quite a while and haven't had a chance to use them, so we'll give them a little dangle here. See uh if they produce. I'm gonna rig this thing up here. Five hours later. Okay guys, so Jetty was a bust, beach was a bust, but we found a, a little hidden gem here. There's a little little reservoir just kinda out in the middle of nowhere here. We're pulling up to this because we still got some time left in the day and we are going to give it a good heart send. And I don't know, see what happens. A nice little seeker here folks this this is a rooster tail and uh i want to say it's a quarter ounce yeah, it's a quarter ounce i actually like them um this size and one size bigger um this orange body with black spots or if you can get it it's an orange body with a crawdad outline in black this will catch trout anywhere anywhere you go and i know that because everywhere i've gone i've caught trout with this lure at least i've known there's been trout in there so always have one of those inside your box you won't be disappointed with it I promise you it is a, uh, a special lure I've caught uh, fish at almost every place that I fished at I've caught fish with that lure
Okay, guys. Well, today's pretty much well, it's, it's the end of the day. <laughs> We've been fishing all day. We started at uh, five o'clock this morning, and we are uh, calling it quits at four o'clock p.m. Got to go to uh, to the house we're going to be staying at and uh, get settled in and stuff. Uh, we got another day uh, coming up that we're going to do a little bit of fishing and stuff. Uh, I'm not really sure exactly where, you know, uh, probably going to be something down the beach here. Um, but yeah, so far it's been kind of a bust. It's definitely been a grind, um, but it's been beautiful weather. So I can't complain. Um, thank you a lot for, uh, you know, following along and everything. Um, I'll probably, yeah, I'll probably end this video here and I'll push the, uh, the next day out on a whole separate video. That way we're not, you know, making, 30 minute long videos and stuff. So, uh, anyways, yeah, it's been a pleasure to bring you guys along. Thank you so much for everything you guys do. I love every single one of you, uh, as always tight lines and, uh, yeah, look forward to the next, uh, fantastic epic trip and, uh, make sure you guys are following Sam with uh, Pacific Northwest uh, fishing TV. Great friend of mine. Um, he's along for this journey as well. And, uh, yeah, link him in the description down below. Uh, make sure you guys go and, uh, check out his videos too. Uh, rather than that, I will see you guys on the next trip. I'll see you guys on the next day. I love every one of you. Thank you so much for everything you do. And I will see you next time. Tight lines, guys. Whew.